So we moved on from the port at Almeria. Just 10 minutes down the road to a little campsite called Camping La Garof. Or something like that. And this is the beach. It's a little cove, a little um, little cove more sheltered from the wind. We've been sitting here all day. Sun is just going down. We've had a lovely day on the beach. It's not my favourite sort of beach because it's a stony one, so we're going to move tomorrow a little bit further down the coast. Find a sandy beach. This is Camping La Garofa. As you can see, the sea is there. And this is where we stayed for the last couple of nights. But we're moving today. Pitch is a little bit small for us. It's an interesting campsite, it's a bit rustic. The beach is pebbly. The service point is inaccessible for a van at our size. So I think time to move. But that bridge is very pretty. But it's right down in this little valley. You've got these big mountains either side. Big bridges over there going across to Almira. Over this side, more mountains. On the plus side, the it's very dark in the mornings. And it's very dark at night. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> No, it's okay, it's a video. <laughs> the people here are really nice, very friendly. Everyone speaks English, so that's a plus side. But as I say, the sun doesn't come up until about half past nine. So all I seem to have done is slept while we've been here. So yeah, time to move, down to the beach. We're at the beach. Another day, another beach. And guess what, we've chosen a windy day. So this is Roquette de Mar, which is about 20 minutes away from where we were this morning. But it's a much nicer beach. Look at that. Got it all to ourselves. Again? Yeah, all we need is a windbreak and we'll pull the chairs out, we'll be fine. <laughs> it is very windy. So we're parked in a car park up there, so it's free. And there's about 50 other motorhomes there. What more could you ask for? Less wind, maybe? Yeah, <laughs> we need the bar to be a bit closer. Yeah. But, you know, we're using the opportunity to wander into town because it is a little bit too windy to sit on the beach. But yeah, town's just here, we're here. Going to see what's open for lunch. It's a castle! We found another Azkaban! As, as, a mini one? <laughs> as, as, cause, cause, cause. Azka whatever it was, it's not yeah. Azkaban. <laughs> what's, the, what's the Harry Potter thing? That's Azkaban. Is it Azkaban? Yeah. This is an Alcazabar. This is an Alcazabar. Pretty. Yeah. I'm not sure it'd be much protection from anything that's invading, but it does look. Well, the cannons look like they're facing in the wrong direction. Yeah, that's that's. They should be facing out to sea, shouldn't they? Yeah. Well, I think those days are long gone. They're here for our entertainment. Well, I thought we'd wander this way round. Have a look at the other side of the cast there. And we've turned up, we're in a little theatre pit. Isn't that nice? Look at that. Ta da! Ta da! <laughs> Come on then, bit of tap dancing. <laughs> wow. Oh, the weather outside is awful.
Come on, friends. What? You, you friends, know, family. No, countrymen. <laughs> I can't remember the words. I just want to say, my family and I. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, help the steps. Wow, this is this this should be great. We've obviously come at the wrong time of year. We need to come back in the summer when they've got all the events on. <laughs> and when we're not getting blasting cold winds. You know. It's like 15 degrees. <laughs> Oops. Oh, this is very nice, isn't it? Look at yeah. that. They've done a good job here. There's another beach over there, is it? Yeah. Look at that. Another beach. Wow, another beach. Look at that. Wow. Come on, wind stop blowing so we can enjoy it. Wow, look at that. That is amazing. We need to come back here in the summer when the wind's not blowing. Yeah, that's lovely. What a nice way they've done this. This is really, really good. I'm very impressed with the way they've developed this area, isn't it? The beach we just walked along. Oh, you can see the waves. <laughs> I don't know what water. The wind's blowing, it's like, I don't know what it is. It's, it's not as quite as high as it was when we were at the, uh, uh, in France at the um, the Camargue. But it's, it's, it's a good Yeah, this is supposed to be only about 15 mile an hour. At the Camargue it was 50. <laughs> so it's not as windy. And actually the wind is not that cold. No, it's here it's, it's okay. On. Yeah, here it's okay. Yeah, yeah, it's okay. I'm just kidding on about being cold. But what a day! Wow! I didn't know they had another beach. They've done, done developed this area really, really quite nicely. Although the beach is a bit exposed. The beach is a bit exposed. Karen says that I don't shout into the mic enough when it's really windy. Yeah, and I can't hear what you're saying when I'm editing it. I'm just cutting you out because I can't hear you. <laughs> so speak up a bit. It's lovely! <laughs> Best honeymoon ever! <laughs> Longest honeymoon ever! <laughs> well, our little walkway is flooded now, so we're going to have to brave the birds. <laughs> Reminds me of a film. Yeah, we'll, we'll see you in a minute. We'll get clipping attacked. Of course we can, look. Oh, maybe not. Let's have a look. Yeah, it's a tiny little stream over there. Put the camera on that. It's a tiny little stream over here, look. Ah, maybe it isn't. Yeah, yeah. On close inspection, it isn't a tiny little stream.
I would choose the uh, big tide. Come on in, it's lovely! When I say lovely, I mean freezing. Come on! Get moving! Before I freeze to death here. show you where we parked last night so this is a car park it's free there's the van not much of a view that side just the mountains but look at this side so we're right on the beach it's a massive car park there must be Ooh, I don't know, 50, maybe 70 vans here. You can see a lot of vans over there. There's another car park up the top. And the vans right over here. So this one was on search for sites. So it's a great, great stop except the wind. It was really windy last night and the wind was coming off the sea. Got absolutely battered. <laughs> but I think we still have our solar panels. <laughs> but I think it's probably too windy to stay here. So we're going to move on today to Al Miramar. There's a couple of places up there at the port. So we're going to go and have a look at those. And if we can't get in there, there's a campsite a little bit further up. So we'll see what we come what we come across today. Well, I'm not sure if you can see that. Is it tight on there before you start sticking it over me? <laughs> yeah, we've already lost uh, a GoPro, but I don't know if you can see those fishes there. Watch them, they're just obviously right, big shoal and just swimming up and down this little bit of the port here. In port Almeriamar. Almeriamar. <laughs> Almeriamar. <laughs> We've got 57 km an hour gusts today, so we're, we're just having a lazy day wandering around the port. Just had breakfast in one of the cafes there. Looking at the size of these fish, just sort of wandering around this little bit. It's really weird. How interesting. <laughs> I don't even know what kind of fish they are. No, they're gone now. They're over here. No, yeah, they're, they're still here. Look, look at that. I'm, I'm not sure if you can see it with a GoPro, but there's like some quite big ones as well. And they're just swimming up and down here. Like they're having a little we we walk yeah we're sheltered from the wind right in this bit so it's, it's quite nice you can take the girl out of england chip party <laughs> or chip corn <laughs> being adventurous though look calamari we're doing tapas again yeah chicken skewer pork rib and that was that was the port, wasn't it? Yeah. yeah it's the port. Yeah. We're, um, we're hiding in from the 57 kilometre an hour It's very windy tonight. Yeah, we're right in the port. You can hear the boats rattling. There's a few, few uh, captains have gone to check on their boats. Make sure all the boats are tied up properly. 
Yeah, I think they're expecting stronger winds tonight. Hope not, because we were battered enough down at Roquette de Mar. <laughs> that wind rocking the van all night. <laughs> so we've come for a little bike ride because we met some people last night who own a coffee. Coffee uh, manufacturer processor. So we thought we would cycle across to see where they are and buy some coffee. But we found ourselves in the middle of these uh, greenhouses. And in these ones they're growing peppers. But look, this is miles and miles. Well, here we are. <laughs> Being adventurous again, because we've come out for breakfast. And look, we have a croissant and a coffee. And we're sitting in a lovely little restaurant called Ralph something. Ralph Puerto. Ralph Puerto. And it's right by the air, which is over there. Actually, you can see the... You can see the van from there. Yeah, you can see the van. <laughs> oh, you're in the shade. Yeah. You've got to turn your head slightly enough. Because the sun's behind me on my back, it's lovely, even though I have got my coat on. But the wind has dropped today, thankfully. <laughs> <laughs> but again, it was noisy last night. There's, there must be nightclubs over here, and it, is a it was a Friday night. And yeah, there seems to be a, a, a theme going on with kids in noisy cars and noisy motorbikes and loud music at weekends. What's all that about? <laughs> but we have made a decision. We are going to change direction because the forecast going west is not as warm as going east. So we're going to go east and we're going to go back to Marizion. Marzion. Marzion. <laughs> However you say it, at that campsite and we're going to spend Christmas there. So we're all booked in, so we have a two hour drive ahead of us. So Let's eat breakfast, do a bit of a video of the air, and get on the road. So this is one of the beaches at Port Almirimar. It's quite a big beach, but it's stony, as you can see. I'm not a great lover of stony beaches. The sea's nice and calm today. Donald's just gone for a wander. You can see the El Capitan over there, that's the lighthouse. And that's where the air is. I'll show you that in a minute. All along the front there's all sorts of restaurants and bars, and many of them are open. So we've had a good four days here. And we might be back, who knows. So, Donald's found the sandy beach. Not a lot of sand. Can't go dipping your toes in that. It's funny how the beach the other side of the port is sandy and yet this one is stony. Look how calm that sea is today. It makes a change from seeing great big waves coming in. <laughs> difference not having 40, 57 kilometers an hour winds make. <laughs> yeah but they're coming back this afternoon so we need to get a move on because the drive down here was pretty awful in those winds. <laughs> Don't want the same going back. <laughs> it's lovely in the sunshine. Cannot complain. Well you we could but no one would listen to you. So this is the port at Almiramar. There's Ralph Puerto, where we've had dinner for a couple of nights. There's an Italian restaurant. Mario's Cafe Bar did really good tapas. Bottle of wine and four tapas for 15 euros.
and this is the air. So they've got fresh water, which is over this side. There's a waste disposal. There's black waste. It was 13 euros a night, which included electric. As you can see, it's not quite level, so we are up on the chocks. But there's a lot of vans here. What do you think of this air? Oh, I've really enjoyed it, looking out over the boats. It's been very nice. So we made it back to Mazaron, and we're in the port, which is very nice. And we're having a menu of the day, which is four courses and a bottle of wine for, I think it's 12 euros each, so 24 euros for four courses. That will do. Oh, big seagull. And we're going to stay here for Christmas. Not sure what we're going to do Christmas Day yet, but it's got a lovely beach. The campsite is fine. The showers are good. And it's only a couple of miles up the road from all the restaurants and bars. So that's perfect. Oh, here comes the wine. Wow, this looks nice. Yeah. <laughs> That's bread. <laughs> That's bread. Chicken consume. Salad. <laughs> and of course, vino tinto. <laughs> so we're now on to our third course. <laughs> it's a bit much for lunch, isn't it, really? <laughs> yeah. Beef and potatoes. Roast potatoes. Yeah, roast potatoes, potatoes, roast beef. So, I guess the only thing left to say on this one, before we close this video off, <laughs> is to wish everyone a Merry Christmas and a happy and prosperous and free, hopefully, New Year. <laughs> <laughs> Cheers. Cheers. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.